welcome to Those Forking Fangirls, where we talk all things nerdy book, TV, movie, pop culture, fandoms, and how they integrate into our adult lives. I'm Natasha. And I'm Christine. And today we're doing something very fun and ridiculous. Yes, we are. <laughs> um, we are Frankensteining together our perfect book boyfriends for from all of our favorite book boyfriends. This is for shits and giggles, all right? It's all in comedic jest. We don't really want this boyfriend. <laughs> um, um, well, maybe a little. Maybe a little. <laughs> okay, so we're not saying this is our real life type, just to clarify. <laughs> like, all these are... As if we if we jumped into a novel and we're experiencing a fictional relationship for the length of the story. So we get to jump in, experience it, hop back out into a real life. All right. So it's a fictional fling. Oh. All right. That's like, news to me, babe. Happily babes. ever after fling. Oh, wait. We don't get to marry them? Yeah. Well, you can marry them in your story and then oh, hop out and no. marry them in so your mind. So I'm creating this person like I would spend the rest of my life with them and well, in real can, life. Well, you don't get to have them forever. You get to spend the rest of your life with them until the end. I don't like those I don't want to give him up. Okay. I'm just <laughs> fine. Well, you can think of it however you want. This is just how I was thinking of it I last want night. him forever. Okay. You can have him forever in your heart. <laughs> So today we have a special guest joining us, Woo! our social media manager, Chloe. Hi, Yay! friends. I'm back. I know you miss me. <laughs> <laughs> XOXO. XO, XO. Very gossip girl. Uh, do you have anything to add, Chloe? Uh, I just, I'm bringing the unhinged energy I always do, the mm -hmm. chaos. And honestly, I'm excited to create my blueprint because I'm yeah. going to compare every man I ever date from now on. <laughs> To this fictional man, because that's so normal and definitely attainable. Yes. It's definitely yes. healthy. Yeah, healthy. That sounds very so healthy. healthy. Thank you. That's that's comedic Jess, just so you know for future <laughs> reference. All right. So before we get into our fictional book boyfriends, of course, as always, we have Snap Crackle pop culture news. I have a Today and Taylor Swift to share. Yes. So Classic. she dropped the next stage and like the grief theory. Like she is Did you buy it? I didn't buy it yet. It's called The Black Dog, and I can't help but get the grim vibes, mm -hmm. like Serious oh. Black. Uh, that is the bonus track that will be on this new version. So right now we've got Manuscript, which I'm going to buy from Target, hopefully. The Bolter, which I have ordered. The Albatross, which I missed my window to order. And then The Black Dog, which I also might have missed my window. I don't know if it's they stopped little... selling it yet. It's a little cuckoo bananas. I haven't bought I'm, it. Yet. I love I'm this for you though. I've only bought one so oh, far. Only, <laughs> only. <laughs> She's making plans though. And I know that I'm going to make buy the first one, the manuscript. <laughs> okay. Obviously, I kind of want to buy this one because of the serious black yeah, vibes. Yeah, me too. Mm -hmm. Also, I just I want them all. I'm sorry. I'm going to get the record version. I feel like I'll get the record version of the Black Dog if it's still available. It okay. is still available. Yeah. <laughs> oh lordy. Just made Christine stay. Yes. So. I definitely getting grim vibes because like a black dog is like yeah. historically a sign of the grim like something's gonna die. Shot says, "LOL, why are there so many versions? It's I the wish five there were." Grief. There's gonna be one more. Okay, okay, sorry. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> but also, I, it's a little ridiculous. It's a little ridiculous. <laughs> she goes, "I wish there was one deluxe with all the songs." Oh, of course, we all wish that. That's the dream, yo. I am the person to defend like everything Taylor Swift yes. does. I really am. Yes. It's just I'm it not. feels like a lot. No, no, this okay, feels like I don't a lot. Know if you remember though, for folklore, there are five different versions, but they that were all exactly the nice. same. You know, yeah, she's cuckoo bananas. Yeah, well, this is the thing. <laughs> we want to break records, and this is yeah. how we break them. That's why we're doing it. Mm. Um, yeah okay you guys didn't know Are, that no well, no <laughs> i was just like capitalist queen yeah that's what no, it's, well, that's what it's coming what it's across about, like because it's all like about the numbers and if you don't have multiple versions people won't buy multiple versions oh yeah. okay okay yep see, i support you in your journey and i love you and yeah. this is truly a great thing for you thanks mm -hmm. thanks i mean i want to co <laughs> collect them all i'm glad chloe agrees with me <laughs> listen right. i am a swifty to my core <laughs> every single day this woman is like anyways besties new drop <laughs> I'm like, Girl, i 
I love the imagery. I love looking oh. at it and like all the little No, things. I eat that shit up every time. The photos are Guys, so I released a TikTok just just being Your like folklore one. The folklore one just we being saw like when people viral. finally believe you. Yeah. It went viral a little bit on TikTok and I've never gotten so many comments in such a short period of time. I opened it after an hour and I had like a hundred comments and I was like, Whoa. <laughs> I love how you. It was you saying, "I told you so." I know. I that was literally. I need to get it off my chest. You're like off my desk. (laughs) You're like, um, I knew first, (laughs) and I just need everyone else to know that that I I know more. I know more than you, and I'm a Taylor Swift expert, and that's the truth. And you should believe me next (laughs) time, okay? So everyone's like, "Where is this video?" And I'm just commenting back, being like. YouTube, uh, you can, search, uh, you, you can search folklore and pull a bananas. You need a bot. And it'll, you need a bot to just respond. Because I can't link yeah. a YouTube into TikTok yeah. comments. You can put it like in have my... a link tree. Oh yeah, I was gonna put it in there yesterday. I forgot because I was out <laughs> with the girlies yeah. in Laguna Beach. Link bio. <laughs> <laughs> I love how like everyone though thinks that it's a uh, like a TikTok. TikTok. I know it's like 2020. No was one the watches beginning long form anymore. TikTok They're like YouTube. Time. Sorry, no, <laughs> never heard of her. I, I only have seven time. second <laughs> attention span. Thanks okay. so much. Okay, um, Tasha. Yeah. So you did you see that the first three like how it the the words are on the album yes. spell out Joe? Yes. So if you connect the dots of the words, it's J O E. But I don't know what the fourth one is. So is that is that theory hold up? Ooh, Joel. Is if that it his was full like name? Joe Al. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, I don't know about that. Gabby says I totally don't. I don't totally believe that Midnight's was denial because it's the whole life night. Yeah, Midnight's is a concept album. So people thinking that Midnight's was a pre breakup album is just not true. I disagree. Every yeah. al- every song on there is from a night where she was up thinking about a relationship. So it's all different relationships she's talking about on that. You can see my, go listen to my Midnight's Breakdown. It's, it's giving plug. Midnight's plug. on YouTube. Type in Midnight's Full of Bananas Books. And you can hear extensive breakdown. Did songs. you connect each um, song, each track with a relationship? I did. Ooh, I did. okay. Yes, I will. I did. I'm interested. I'm intrigued. No, and it, <laughs> it's very accurate in my opinion. <laughs> and, and in two years, she's going to make a TikTok and it's going to go viral and she's going to tell everyone, I told You're you like, so. Guys, <laughs> I've been talking about this for years. <laughs> no one's been listening. <laughs> Your goal is to make more of those so that Taylor will see them and then invite you yes. in and in term invite you. Well, me. this is the thing. I'm letter. almost worried because it's so accurate that she's oh, like, I so don't she like it. Why are you it. in my head, girl? Yeah. But why like, you know it's my because shit. we're soul sisters, we have the same thinking. Mm, mm. That's why the thing is, I was going through exactly what it was talking about. So I knew exactly, like, it was so accurate. I was like, it has to be about this. Mm. Um, and like, since we're the same age and going through like the same year, you know, every year you kind of go through different crises. And I think we're in the same space. There. We're in the same crisis. Yes, we are. Yeah. We Where's are. your Travis Kelsey, though? Yeah, I know. I'm waiting. One. You're due. I'm on, a, I'm on about a year delay with her. Oh, so oh, I'm due. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. So I'm in a year, you're Travis. going to be. Oh, I'm going to be wow. 34 this year, and she just had her 34 year. So oh. I'm like about a year behind, and it actually tracks. Like, she was in love with Joe, and then I fell in love the next year with John. Yeah. And then she fell out of love with Joe, and I fell out of love with John. And it was Tragic. sad times. Um, tragic. Mm-hmm. Um, okay, so we're gonna be on the lookout for, for your Travis, Travis Kelsey. I'm waiting. Um, I love that for you. Yeah. We want to make sure that he's on a good team, goes to Super Bowl, the whole thing. Yeah. The right jock level for me. <laughs> we're about to see. On uh, my which is fictional. zero. <laughs> no, I like I like a little jock. A little Ooh. bit. A little bit. A little bit. Okay. Um, all right, Natasha, do you have news for us? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Give it to us. So Doom Part 2 came out this weekend, and it actually made $81 million in its opening weekend, Ooh. which is actually better than it projected because, I think this is really interesting, it was project- projected to do $65 million. And another little tidbit, it cost them less to make Dune than to make Ant-Man Quantumania. I certainly didn't see that. <laughs> I didn't either, so, and I don't care about it. No, I, I is it just either. because the actors wanted more money? No, Paul Paul Rudd though. I bet Paul Rudd cost well, but Timothy Chalamet and Zendaya, Zendaya. and Austin so Butler. much good um, Evangeline talent. Lilly and 
Yeah, but I feel like oh, Paul Michelle Rudd is Pfeiffer, more special. Michael yeah. Douglas. Like those older actors, I bet pull a lot. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah pretty expensive. penny. But, uh, okay, so anyway, so it this is this is the first blockbuster of 2024 um, because... Because it, uh, it, Spider Woman didn't count. I mean, well, Madam Lady Web, Spider. Of course. Madam Web. Oh, what did you say? We had Spider Madam Web Madam is what lady. I meant to say. Spider Lady. <laughs> Um, we had like Mean Girls come out this year. What else did we have come out this year? When you say we, well, who do you who are you talking about? Us as the entertainment industry. Oh, oh, we had oh. Lisa Frankenstein. <laughs> I was like, I was like the girls. So, but, but guys, the so, so there actually hasn't been a big opener since Eras. That was oh, in October. So okay. all of our Christmas movies didn't make big bucks. I can't remember a single Christmas movie. I know all Wonka. the Oscar movies. Wonka. Oh, did yeah. anyone see Wonka? No. 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 What about The Color Purple? Did that one just knock it? Uh, no. I want to see The I Color Purple. I bet it's incredible, but, yeah, but it, it didn't, do, didn't, it, it didn't do its thing. Yeah. yeah. We're like that cuddling time. over here. Yeah. Hi. I'm all alone. <laughs> Boo hoo. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> Because you wore blue to the pink party. Yeah, <laughs> we all if were like, can't we're see, gonna wear I'm we're gonna wear blue. pink today. It's gonna be cute. We're all gonna be coordinated. <laughs> oh my god, put your shirt down. Stop getting Stop. naked. What are you doing? Because <laughs> I was like, I'm wearing something cuter underneath, but I'm not. No, you're so cute. Okay. It's just you're wearing blue. Yeah. Wait, did you put it on backwards? Yeah, she did. Yeah, because I didn't want the writing or the stain. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's the writing. <laughs> <laughs> all right <laughs> gabby said listen christine don't want no other shade of blue but you thank oh, you gabby that's gabby stop flirting with her she's on top of it <laughs> i love the reference what do you got for us chloe um chloe. i think i have literally nothing Wait, oh, I, did, oh, did yes, you write this I totally do. actually i was i was shook and i like had to i almost like threw my phone we were on air when we got this news <laughs> cool and <laughs> and um i see a tiktok of margot robbie and sarah j mass together and i'm immediately like <gasps> all right can i just point out though we don't see sarah j mass's face and we're just supposed to go on good nature yeah. that that's her it's actually because sarah. we know sarah's hair and it didn't look like her hair it's oh. very long it's very long but i mean it has been we just saw her at the releases and she didn't have as long of a hair. The and, flexing that's happening right now and she didn't in front of me. <laughs> as much like uh, the same consistency hair. I mean, it could be her and it's just like we're analyzing the hair too hard. You, didn't Sarah J. Mass's friend confirm it was her? Oh, I don't know. I didn't ooh, see that. See? Okay. See, maybe okay. there's been more since we saw the picture. But, so, and I have some more. Okay. Ooh. Tell us. Okay. So this is going to sound very bougie. Okay, bougie. But why? <laughs> I, I went to tea with the social media director from Hulu on Saturday. Um, Is this allowed to be told out she loud? She hiring? Yes. Okay. <laughs> um, so she didn't tell me. It, she didn't confirm anything. Okay. But I, I literally, we were talking about Akatar and I looked at her and I was like, did you see? Did you, <laughs> did you see? Did chance that did you maybe? <laughs> Robbie, listen. Okay, she's in marketing at Hulu. It's very different yeah. than production. Yeah. Um, and she's like, I she did. She might know and a little I bit. Immediately though. went um to my my whoever, and she's like, Did you know about this? So they are talking about that. It. Gives I me a lot of a hope. very good chance that Margot Robbie would want to produce. Yeah. One of her series. She also has so many mm -hmm. properties. So it could be any of them. It doesn't have to be Akatar because that's true. I'm sure all of her properties are being in yeah. the process of being produced right now because she's so she's hot so big. Right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I. It just gives me a lot of hope that whichever property it is mm -hmm. will be done well yes. and successfully and yes. with the female gaze and that yes. makes me really really happy yes. Yes. everything margot robbie has touched recently i have loved I, except for that movie I from that like the up. 1920s where she was an actress i didn't like that one I don't even know what oh, you're talking the, the about hollywood one yeah oh but uh, oh. She, i don't think she had produced that or anything she was okay just she was just in it babylon yeah, um <laughs> I never heard of her. Never heard of her. What was it? Babylon? Babylon. Babylon. Never heard of her. I just love Margot Robbie so much. And I think that if she's on a project. I, wow. Really? Me and Margot? Oh. 
I thought she was so much older than Oh, you. thanks. Yeah, you're just hot and young. Thanks. Well, she's really hot, so yeah, I don't know what that was about. She's, That's what I thought. She's not old. No, I'm pretty I sure she was born in 1990. I thought, I thought she was like 37, 38. Okay, she's 33. She I think it maybe no, she doesn't look it at all. I think it's because she's so successful in my head. You've so like she has to be older. Age, yeah. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Yeah, I think like every time I think about Taylor Swift, I gotta age, Google it and make sure. No, 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 Google it, Google yeah, it. Yeah. But anyways, Margot Robbie is a goddess, and um, I'm into it. I saw her in person at the Barbie. <gasps> of course you did. And 33. She. Oh my god. I'm like July 2nd. We're both summer babies. So when I saw her, it was at the after party at the Barbie premiere and she was surrounded by like all these men in suits. And then there was like, like, that's so Barbie. It felt like there was like a spotlight on her because I, we like Tay and I just walked by and she just has this million dollar smile and Mm. her skin. Yeah. It's glowing. Glowing. Always glowing. It's perfect in real life too. Yes. And we saw her and I'm like, (sighs) she just, she doesn't look real. What was the dress she was wearing to the actual Barbie premiere? It was, was a it black that, one. Oh, it was a black one. Mm-hmm. So, little, stunning. Yeah. She, so stunning. So stunning. At the after party, she was wearing a shortened version of it. Oh, my God. I I ate up every single one of her looks, and they live rent-free in my head. Mm-hmm. And she started almost sort of a revolution when it comes to press, doing press for your movies and TVs. I know that she's not the first that did it, but, like, taking... Say, yeah, 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 yeah. But <laughs> taking inspo, I feel like, now has become mainstream. Yeah. Um, and we saw it with the Avatar Last Airbender premieres, and I'm living for it i love the creativity i love us going outside of the box when it comes to fashion and like leaning into the character yes Mm -hmm. me too all right i think that's all our news so we're all very excited about the prospect of margot robbie being involved in making one of sarah's films and starring as aelin or i don't think she'd be bryce but like she could do aelin or feyre i think i don't think you want her to be bryce because you don't love bryce i want her to be nesta Mm. i really think she might be like Aelin. She could slay any of those roles, though. Whatever she wants to do. Whatever she wants to do. With Sarah's books, <laughs> I'm happy. We're, 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 on, we're on the team. Yes. <laughs> All right. One last thing I have today is Hack Season 3 was announced. We were just talking about it last week. Oh, yeah. And it's coming May 2nd so soon. And there's a trailer, but I didn't watch it because I don't like to be spoiled about anything comedy. Mm. But I'm so bummed. Oh, yeah i'm pumped for you thank you thank you all right so we're gonna go into our main discussion but i want to take a second real quick and thank everyone out there listening we love you if you're not already we'd love it if you follow the podcast for free in your favorite podcast listening app you can also watch a visual version of the show on youtube we have every episode visually at youtube.com so at those working fangirls if you like to watch and you could subscribe for free on YouTube so that you never miss an episode there. And we also have a Patreon. I want to thank our patrons who are here in the chat. If you're a patron, you get to be here live with us while we're recording. And today we had some technical difficulties. So thank you so much for sticking with us yeah. and being patient. <laughs> we're all live today. So our video is really fun. We're all together in the same room. Our patrons are sexy. I can we- touch you now. Uh, we forking <laughs> love our Patreon community. If you're interested in joining, there's a lot of fun perks. Like I was saying, we have an extra show after every single show called Ferngold Tea Time. It's half an hour. This is episode 65. So if you subscribe as a patron now, you get access to 65 Ferngold Tea Times. It's and and the first level team Jacob is and up is all ad free. So if you want your show to be ad free, you can become a patron. You can also we offer a free trial so you can try it out for seven days. See if you like it before it charges you. And we also offer a discount if you want to subscribe annually instead of month to month. So you're saving about 16 percent, which is about a month and a half from um, your yearly fee if you were subscribing month to month, which is really cool. We love all our patrons. It's a really great community, and we appreciate you so much. It's time. Let's do this. It's time to Frankenstein, our ideal fictional boyfriend, using pieces of all of our past fictional boys or fictional girls. So whatever you want, 
it's just it's a freewheeling ordeal fun loving fun loving <laughs> ordeal all right so we're gonna go through and like form our guys and then like we'll help each other tell a little story of our relationship when we finish okay mm. okay so okay. the first category i have down here is hair like so like hair like what book boyfriend okay mm -hmm. So I have hair like Edward Cullen. I want it to be bronze AF and floofity flippity floops. <laughs> which just like which era? Twilight yes. era. Yes, Edward. Yes, the best hair. I want that floof lift Um, what? Sorry, one more time. The floof lift. One more time. Floof lift. Oh, okay. <laughs> Got it. I want the floof lift lift. <laughs> You want the flop. the flop. You want like when he's jogging. I want like, like a like little a bouffant. He, you know the oh, bouffant? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, he, I don't want the likes, like the she likes volume. I want the volume. Christine's yeah. all about hey, hair volume. I am. I like <laughs> so that big with, hair. So with the hair volume, do you want like Rob's like fingers like the No. I want Edward Cullen, but Rob's hair. Well, isn't okay, that not sorry. the same? They've merged for a lot of people. Yeah. Yes. So that's why I'm saying his hair. Got it. Okay. Like, yeah. Okay. The bouffant. Didn't he have highlights in one of them that were really bad? I don't know. I don't pay enough attention to hair. I think there was highlights that happened that were a little there was upsetting. highlights in the first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But they weren't, they weren't bad. staunch. Yeah. Staunch. <laughs> I remember like a, a, like a particular, like a blonder. What do you mean blonder. by staunch? Highlights. I just mean they were a little like aggressive, <laughs> like a little hit in the face, you know. Um, All the other movies, they're just he just has like dark hair. Yeah, maybe it's New Moon. Maybe it's New Moon. You need someone who matches your volume because you have voluminous hair. So I do. you need I love hair. Okay, so okay. I want, like I nice also hair on hair. my boy. I love hair too. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, what are you looking for, Chloe? Give us your hair. I'm also in the Twilight realm. Oh my gosh, who? Jasper? But no, what? <laughs> what? Please. Um, okay, Jacob Black. Oh, Jacob Black. Book one? Book one. Book, oh, book specific. Yeah. I okay. love a long, luscious, gorgeous mane. Oh I want like and a attached at the hip, there's a character with that. Kind Hot. Of hair. I can't wait. Yeah. A ponytail, love. A man bun. I love, love a man bun. But I'm now. talking about what I pictured in my head man really when I read me. the book. Oh. Not that ugly, stanky ass wig. <laughs> no, not from the first one the, the second one's a little better a little bit but the wig is not good but the concept of long hair on a man yeah. like if ugh. it's nice to take care of mm. yeah i love it <laughs> i don't like it as much down as i like it like in a in a bun no i love it i want a man to have like hair as long as me yeah it's my fantasy i wanted i love like okay. like um like viking hair yeah okay. oh, oh. Yeah. Ragnar Lothbrok. Wait, oh my god. Wait, I forgot. I, f I have, From Vikings. I, yeah. I was obsessed We're with him. We're getting so horny one. in this episode. <laughs> I love his hair and his wife. Like, she's beautiful. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, Natasha, you want to give us your hairs? Yes. So, I forgot about the Viking hair for a second here. But I first put down uh, Kylo Ren. Love. But Kylo Ren, mm. when he first takes... <laughs> Hot. Shut Hot. up. <laughs> when he first takes the helmet off, mm. and then you see this beautiful prince you, yeah. unveiled. Beautiful prince. Shut up. <laughs> he is. Uh, he's hot. He's a little he's, prince boy with his beautiful. He's an angst. He's an angsty boy. Yeah. Adam Driver is hot. He's an Thank you. Boy Period. I yes. just get so much angst from him. Christine likes a pretty boy. <laughs> Come on. I like. I mean, I like Henry Cavill. That's pretty for sure. Yeah. But like, I'm I like, feeling like, like Christine. Like, look. Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Boring. <laughs> yes, but like the, the another curly... way me and Taylor Swift are on the same page. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. None of Taylor Swift's exes are hot until uh, Travis Kelsey. Travis. <laughs> okay. Well, do you think Travis Kelsey's hot? Uh, I mean, oh my. Get out of here. I don't think, I mean, like, I wouldn't go for him. But, like, she, what in her song, you? say, like, I love that boyish look in a man or something. She's got that boyish look I love in a man. Okay. Like, so Harry I... Styles has a boyish look. You don't like Harry Styles? I'm going to, the girls, the girlies are going to be like, mad. Are you The girlies kidding? are going to be mad. I do not like, think he's are, hot. And whoa. his toupee is really hanging on for dear okay. life. His toupee? It's oh, not yes. a toupee. He oh. had his haircut. He, he just short shaved hair. it. And then he did get hair plugs. 
No, he got hair blonde. Okay, I don't care. It looks good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. (laughs) We don't care either. I just don't think he's hot. He's not like he's he's not like my main dude. I do think when I saw (laughs) him in concert with short hair, he does like he has sex appeal. He is swag. He is is absolute swag. swag, One hundred percent. How can you say that none of her boyfriends have been hot? That's how. That's how I feel. Was hot. No, he was pretty. He was. Yeah, I think he looks a little rat like. Wow. <laughs> I also don't really like in bl- I like don't with like friends, blonde I men. really like I just don't think blonde men should exist in real life. Oh my god, I'm attracted to blonde men. I yeah. think it's cuz I have fair hair. I feel like that's I a mean, thing. so do I. Yeah. I just don't think like unless it's Draco Malfoy. Taylor Lautner. I don't like Draco Malfoy ex. hair. That's true. Taylor Lautner. Oh my god. Taylor Lautner so hot. I talked about his hair. How can you not say his that? Face. How can you say that? He was hot. He was hot. You're right. You're right. I okay, I take it back. Taylor Lautner was hot, okay? I, mean, I also think Jake Gyllenhaal is hot, but yes. like I, he but gives I me the ick. He gives me the icks, me. Yeah. He's always given me the ick. Okay, though. we were supposed to do fictional men, and we've really gotten okay, okay. on to real oh, sorry, men. Sorry. All right. Anyways, sorry. rewind Coming back, back to, to Kylo Ren Kylo and Ren. Snape. Kylo Ren, shoulder length, curly, big waves. You would look so good with Kylo Ren. Thank you. you would. You would look so good with Kylo Ren. You would. Yeah. yeah. Someone write that fic, please. <laughs> <laughs> next category we have here is the humor of and natasha you start us off like whose humor are you looking I for what such level? a hard time with this really me I, too me too really yeah because i because i'm really trying to think back of like what who what book like did you made think was me, funny like what made me giddy mm. funny and like who was because i'm like oh my god who, it's so many who in my life makes me wow. laugh like i was trying me. to Yes. <laughs> what about me? Me too. Yeah, me, we all make it, too. No one's funnier than us. So how do we? How do we pick? Yes. <laughs> and so first, I put down Thor, but for Thor from okay. Ragnarok. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I like that because I don't like being teased. I get a little oh God, hurt sometimes. That. I never get hurt. Unless I get, it's me. I, I like. I like. I like to a like little teasing, degree. but then I can get mean, and then it gets bad. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Natasha can get mean, huh? <laughs> hot <laughs> and, I, and i just don't get it i'm like okay stop i'm done like oh, this, <laughs> that, that hard line like out. crossy like for yeah. me like roasting is a love language and i need that oh, oh, i will roast you i am a roast no i like mean, live long day yeah in a I way know. that's not mean you know what i mean there's a line yeah, there's, yeah, a line. there's a line there's a line there's a line, there's a line. And, um you won't know that you don't you want to be like it bitch you're christine crying. you're a bitch <laughs> noted that's not a rose got it got it got it <laughs> that's just mean um which i guess i may i don't get to that point <laughs> i'm just, you're like i think <laughs> i think it depends who I you can are get, i can get kind of mean too yeah okay so thor um because he's got like that stupid dumb humor and yeah it's like it's like cute. body humor yeah. too and it's just like cute yeah yeah and you're just like mm. nice especially when he tells that little story about the snake with loki yes like, and I, yeah. I would have just been <laughs> no yeah he's living. funny he's yeah. funny yeah. oh all right chloe um i also really struggled with this and i genuinely think it's because i don't think any men are funnier than me i think <laughs> women are funnier than me all the time but every man i meet i'm like <sighs> you know when you said this though you sent it via text you're like okay like ron weasley's humor and i actually kind of yeah I think Ron I Weasley. I was thinking of that for I you. I love Ron Weasley's humor. <laughs> I think there's moments where he gets a little too mean mm-hmm. and he crosses the line, um, but he's funny. He's really funny. Yeah. He's a lot of really great moments, and I I think that that was the only person that stood out to me besides banter. But we have that later, and I think banter is a different, different type of funny. funny. Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, I think Ron, like clever, funny, yeah, and funny is like you're Ron funny Weasley too. like makes yeah. me laugh out loud. Yeah, in yeah. the book, in the yeah. movies, not so much. But book Ron, book absolutely, Ron. Book yeah, Ron. yeah. So last night I was um, with my best friend from New Jersey and one of her close friends from um, med school, and. She was talking about like she's also single, and she was talking about like what is your top thing that you look for? And I was like humor, and she's like humor's not even on my top ten list. Really? <laughs> and that was just like so baffling to Ooh. me. But anyway, like humor is like the first thing that I feel like attracts me to a person after like just like initial looking. You're so funny though, so I think that's why. Like you need someone that well, matches yeah, your I energy. I want someone to make me laugh too. Yeah. yeah. So anyway. For me, I want the humor of Will Herondale, my dream man. Oh. I fucking... Who I is was, this? 
um, from the oh, Infernal baby. Devices oh, by Cassandra oh, 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 Clare. Yes, 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 Only yes. one of the best YA trilogies. Why are you looking at me like that? Time. Why are you looking at Have me like that? Have you not read it? No. <laughs> <laughs> the attitude. I'm like look at the camera. The attitude with my book husband Will Herondale. <laughs> well, he's all he's all yours then. You're not competing with me. Yeah. Yeah. He's probably not your type. <laughs> True. He probably isn't because we have very different types, <laughs> as we've already established, um, just with hair. <laughs> <laughs> Good, babes. I was torn between Jace and Will, and I, I, I ultimately was like Will. Will's. I. He's so silly and funny, and he. I always am giddy laughing yeah, whenever he says literally anything. <laughs> like, mm. man, he, he sang a song, and it was funny. <laughs> Demon Fox. Shots is like, if you did not say well, I was going to sue. <laughs> Everyone called it. In and the he's chat. got a great, great sense of sarcastic timing. <laughs> okay, okay. Yes. Yes. I think I think also when you really like someone, they do make you giddy laugh. Yeah. Even when they say things that are just yeah. like not that funny. Yeah. But if you really like someone, it's like, see, ah. like the same for Jace. Like I get fucking giddy when he I, says anything. I see that. I do see that. I do see that one for sure. All right. Every book boyfriend has their toxic trait. People are flawed. People have flaws. So what is your fictional frankenstein boyfriend's toxic trait going to be chloe you start us off this time oh i'm starting okay starting mine is mine is i went to tv show okay that's fine we can do that red foreman what from, from that, that from that show? Show. listen oh listen to God. me so before we judge chloe okay <laughs> before we um make some judgments here i'm not talking about red's looks All okay right. Red is a bald old man for anyone who hasn't watched that. Which there's nothing wrong with that. And And he always says, how about a a a kick in the ass? Yeah, a foot in your ass situation. Um, He has this really beautiful scene with Kitty, who is his wife of a very long time. Mm -hmm. And he talks about how he potentially wants to get social and like actually start meeting friends and making an effort. And then they do that. And everyone leaves. And he says, you know, I really hate everyone except you oh my gosh i think i remember that. and i want that i want that energy i don't want my future husband to like anyone except me (laughs) toxic yes my truth also yes like i just want i just want shot um, says so valid yeah no no i just want like a grumpy man that like only a has a heart yeah that that's only made has for a Chloe. heart for me yeah yeah and that way i don't have to be jealous because like he only Taren. likes me Taryn in uh, fourth wing yes yeah. yes oh, one thousand you percent. want that energy yeah yeah <laughs> okay. yeah same vibes for sure i hate everyone but you <laughs> see everyone judge me but now they're probably like oh love yeah, yeah. <laughs> whole says love that <laughs> thanks, thanks babe <gasps> all right natasha what's your toxic trait happening this is my so only... we've got Kylo Ren's hair. So this is far. my this is my with only the humor double. of Thor. Liking Kylo Ren is already toxic. So <laughs> my toxic trait is Kylo. <laughs> <laughs> Me, I knew it. I didn't look. Oh, we, that we is didn't an look anger at each... problem, folks. <laughs> we also didn't look at each other's things. We wanted it to be a surprise, yeah. just so everyone knows. I kind of referenced Christine just to like see what she was doing, but I didn't like go fully for Uh-oh. it. Wants to rule the world with me beside him. Hot. No, Ooh. that's hot. Yeah. In an evil way? I don't want to rule the world. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I for sure crafted a villain. That stresses me out. Crafted <laughs> a villain who only, who does everything for me. <laughs> That's what the love you destroys. Just she did this side so on. love is to destroy is what Natasha's building. <laughs> Natasha has villain tendencies. <laughs> And that's a okay, me. and we love her the dark anyway. Vibes. I also have villain Shot tendencies. Set. I feel like Christine's the only one that's not villainous. She's like she's the golden retriever. Yeah, I am a poodle. Oh my god! Wow! Whoa! Wow! I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> no, I I know she's a poodle because she's smart. Yeah, golden's gonna be really dumb, and I don't want to be called one. Okay. Oh, we're sorry. Okay. We'll never do that again. <laughs> boundary. <laughs> Hard boundary. Do not call me a golden. Okay. Um, you can call me a golden. But I'm fine. I feel like you're more like a Pomeranian. A love. Okay. They're yeah. yappy. <laughs> 
<laughs> they gotta bite a little. Wait, what but they're pretty. Am I? Yeah, I'm trying uh, to figure it out right now. You, like, you... wait, what about a Doberman? No, they're really tall no. and gentle. Okay. Oh, the, I like Sometimes. that. They're regal yeah. too, actually. And regal. Yeah, yeah they're I very like regal. I would say, um, oh, like a German Shepherd, actually. Okay. Because they're That's strong funny. and gorgeous, and I feel they... like Dobermans are prettier. Oh, I mean, well, it's just up to like, like it's an opinion. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> One of those. So my boyfriend's toxic trait is going to have Percy Jackson's, which is mostly silliness. <laughs> that is not toxic. That's not toxic. No, That's he's not silly toxic. in serious times. So he'll be oh. like, we'll be about to die. And he'll be like making jokes with the person who's going to kill him to distract. that counts. That's not that toxic. doesn't count. Like, what don't do you, you want, if you're about to die, don't you want someone to make humor light of the situation? Yeah, I know. That's why I like humor. That's not Silly. toxic. Well, what is toxic about Percy Jackson? Toxic positivity, Tiffany says. I can do with some toxic positivity, honestly. All right. Okay. We'll do it with, I like that, Tiffany. All right. Thank toxic you. positivity. Thank you. <laughs> I, toxic, actually, toxic positivity is one of my most, like, It can get on your things. nerves a lot. Yeah, yeah. I don't love that. Just um, be just be real. Yeah. Like, the plane will be going down, and personally, like, you know, I love you, and it's going to be fine, because, like, we're here together, and it's going to be fun when we hit the water and i'll be like i'm anxious and he'll be like it's gonna be okay instead of being like it's okay to be anxious oh mm -hmm. okay i get that i see yeah. that yeah. there uh -huh. we go all right what is the troubled backstory of mm. your boy i put down superman that he was sent to another planet by himself and raised in the middle of nowhere oh uh, so that is really tragic yeah. really bad social skills <laughs> yeah alone a loner and he's like, well that kind of goes with the whole thor humor like he's a fish out of water on yeah Earth. that's so, so much better though that. when someone's really really hot but like a loner yeah yeah for sure because you're like what why yeah. i would never want that person but like i like it for you <laughs> He, I this is I this is for fun. Oh, I I'm, know for you in your fictional world. In my fictional, world, yeah. I'm like, yes, I would love to marry him in my fictional world. Yeah, mm. but maybe not. Like, I don't want him here now. Like, you, you don't, don't want, want him throwing cups Superman. at the ground and being like another. Well, maybe <laughs> for fun. For funsies. Yeah. For fun, you want to just throw uh, the cups. You want to have a situation yes. with Superman. You do. Yes. <laughs> Got it. Okay. And throw the cups. And he can keep some kryptonite in the closet for when he's annoying. Yeah. Yeah. Like, get away. <laughs> Seems a little abusive. <laughs> <laughs> Not gonna lie. Yeah, that's literally like yeah, if you're, you're allergic right. to peanuts, you're like, yeah, yeah you have airborne. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> Don't do that, kids. Don't do that. That was I toxic. take it back. I take it back. This is fictional. This is our toxic. <laughs> 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 so you want the troubled backstory of Superman. Chloe, what troubled backstory is your long-haired beauty going to have? Um, uh, I'm picturing him, and I'm like, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited. You're a long-haired Ron Weasley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, the, the amalgamation of things that I've created is truly Girl, next level. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, take a look at this. Uh, Zuko <laughs> from ooh. Avatar The Last Airbender. Oh, well, that's a good one. Banished from his family? I think our daddy issues oh. would get along. Yeah. His daddy issues and my daddy issues, I think we would bond. Oh. And I think we would resonate with each other. And um, that's why. I think that genuinely we could understand each other in like a deeper way. Okay. Yeah. Like that. So that's why I want. And I like also that. like, I think I could build him up. You know, I'm like a builder. Does he get his fun uncle too? Yeah. I am I hope he comes with Iroh. Yeah. Yeah. I'd invite Iro to dinner yeah. to have dinner with us yeah yeah i love iro iro's fabulous All he's right. honestly he's the perfect man i don't know why we're doing this actually <laughs> iro or zuko no, iro's got iro. the man iro, bun yes. he's got the curmudgeon he go. does honestly and he's grumpy book not three kind of. iro like he's kind of got all my things like <laughs> He's older. He's big Always and sexy. So old. <laughs> he's so old. Oh my Anyways. god. <laughs> anyway, I had to go back to mine because I just realized why I like the aspect of him, like kind of being an orphan, because I'm an Aww, orphan, baby. I know. I was oh like, my god. I like that. Yeah. You guys yeah, are, and you guys could. So you're it's not each just a situation. Ship. It could be yeah. real, real babe. You're real. in a family for Make each other. Family. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Can you adopt me? That's really nice. Of course. Okay. We've already cool. been adopted. <laughs> it's, we come with Natasha. <laughs> yeah, we'll just be a family. How about that? Yeah. <laughs> so mine 
is going to be he fell in love with the same person as his brother, just like Damon Salvatore. Oh, of course. And then that person passed away. And then I look exactly like them. <gasps> and he's going to find me and fall in love with me. Wow. And it's going to be weird. This is your next book. We like brothers. <laughs> they love brothers. Oh, wait. So this is basically Vampire Diaries. Well, no, because he's not a vampire. This happened recently. So he's still getting through he's just it. just a like human. Like 10 years ago. So he was 20 when it happened. Now he's 30. Regular old lad. Just a lad. Just a lad. Yeah. Okay. Okay. But his tragic backstory is a love loss that his brother also was in love with. Okay. Then does his brother then fall in love with you? Maybe oh, yeah. a little, but I like him better because he's more like Damon. You, in a you, non-murder you like the way. boyfriend. You like your boyfriend, not his brother. Yeah, I like my boyfriend. Uh, and his brother okay. maybe has like a crush happening uh, that I have to uh-huh. be like, no. Oh, got oh. it. But Why then, not have them both? Well, that was always my issue. I don't want Conrad. I just want Jeremiah. Oh, oh yeah. I want a sandwich. <laughs> I want both <laughs> all the time. I would, I would dabble and then I would choose. I mean, I relate to that. But once again, if I could have both all the time, I would have both all the time. Really? Yes. That uh, sounds complicated. That yeah. sounds incestual a little because they're brothers. Yeah. No, we talked about this off air, but I'm fine saying it on air. I'm okay with that. <laughs> okay. Yeah. We like brothers. <laughs> okay. So sibling status. I'll kick this one off. So for, for sibling status, I'm asking, like, do you want an oldest child, middle child, younger child, only child? I want an oldest child because I feel like we mesh really well. And for that, I'm choosing Will Herondale because I feel like he's a very loving, caring person. And he's, like, does everything he can to make sure everyone's okay, even, mm. like, the people who aren't his younger <laughs> siblings necessarily why are we the same <laughs> i just made the exact same noise the exact same pitch with the exact same timing <laughs> we we were really I'm moved like, I, we yes. were really moved yes. that was what the sound was mm-hmm. okay what about y'all sounds like will might just be your dream man too he yeah is just like ira ira's mind yeah yeah, he, yeah will is my dream man but i'm like putting together some yeah, you yeah, know yeah, an yeah. amalgamation of frankenstein man at the end of the day I want a middle sibling because Ooh. they're just grateful for any attention. <laughs> oh, <laughs> and I think that that's pretty um, attainable. Like I yeah. can do that. Yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, um, you just give a love the kernel every now men, and then, and it's fine. I'm currently seeing is a middle middle sibling, oh, wow. and he's happy with any attention. <laughs> oh, okay. So that's good yeah. to know. Uh, life hack: <laughs> pick a middle sibling. Uh, they're a lot they less can have needy. Angry issues that's that's valid that's yeah. so so valid yeah because they didn't get enough attention mm-hmm. in their youth and then they rebel in weird referencing ways referencing someone yes i have a middle sibling and i also know middle siblings that mm. are also like that. <laughs> i know a middle sibling or two <laughs> i don't know uh, all i know are, I don't you think... don't have like that doesn't yeah. work yeah, for you have you. the youngest oldest Wait. Dynamic. Uh, that, yeah. You have yeah, that's true. You're definitely the oldest in yeah. this yes. sitch. You know how much older I am than Alex? I don't know, like a minute. <laughs> Tiffany says I'm a middle sibling. I have to beat this allegation. <laughs> <laughs> Tiffany, I would give you all the attention you deserve because you are worth it. I'm just saying in general. I'm middle just siblings. saying in general. I know some middle siblings, and they're all kind of rebellious in like an evilly way to like get attention. I kind of like evil a little. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> For anyone who is wondering, I am 54 minutes older than Alex. 54? Yes. Woof. I know. Oh, my God. Sorry to our mother. Yeah. It wasn't my fault. <laughs> I was I ready. Got, I, I was prompt. I was ready. <laughs> I was prompt. I <laughs> love it. Not like I am prompt all the time anymore. But. Um, Peaks well, early. Because of who my backstory, I said only child. Okay. Yeah. Mm. That makes sense. For um, yours. Just say you want me. I want you. Okay. Only children are are interesting. They need a lot of attention. Yes. Yeah, I have a few in my life, mm-hmm. and it's is Tay an only child? No, oh, she's okay. got a brother. Okay. Now we're going to go to intelligence levels. How smart do you want your boy to be? Now. For me, this is complicated because I kind of do. I like when my boyfriend is just as smart or smarter. I can't agree. I can't do less Agreed. than that. Yeah. Um. When they're smarter, it's really nice because sometimes when you are having trouble like figuring something out, they can figure it out. I mm-hmm. love that. Like, yeah. I, I hate when like it's all dependent on me. So I think I'm probably looking for smarter than me. 
And I really think Charlie Lastra from Book Lovers embodies <gasps> this love quick him. wit that I, love I him, fucking I love, him, love, I love him. so much. Yeah, I love him. like little writer buddies together. That's so yes. cutie. Yes. I love that. Yes. So I he's love an that. editor, but like, you know, we can like work oh, on. Te- technicality. Sorry. Work on yes, story together, <laughs> which I love. I was getting, I always get her books mixed up. I'm like, who? I've read them all Thanks multiple someone. times, so I know them. <laughs> um, but yeah, Charlie Laster for me. What about you, Natasha? Okay, so I feel because I my dad was an engineer, and I feel like I I didn't realize this, but I pretty I'm pretty sure I got his engineer brain because of. Oh my god, are of, you a math girly? Of how good I am at sewing. yeah, that's true. And I have to yeah, use so like a fucking math. Together. You use steel. Yeah, she can your see video how the other day. together. Yeah, no. <laughs> yeah, and I can if I and if I can see it, I can put it together. I put Iron Man because I'm like, wait, the, I love that. Yeah, me too. Like I'm like, I'm oh my gosh, he could just make all like the coolest things and like make our house so high yes. tech, true, and just like make our life so much easier with his yes. brain. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like, I wouldn't have to <laughs> like. <about> to... <laughs> I love him. I didn't think about Christine's Iron turned Man. on. I love him. <laughs> Iron Man's not like one of my favorite. He's so like, smart, and I love like that. Boy, he's so big brain. I'm so, so attracted to his brain. Yeah, me too. He's so clever and funny he's too. Very clever and funny. Yeah. So I know. Um. So he's a big heart. Yeah, so definitely I want, like, a smart, like, doer. Mm. Yeah. I love a doer. Me too. Who can do things with their hands and yes. can make things. Yes, me too. I mean, that's also another category. She likes a doer that can uh, do things with her, their hands? Yeah. <laughs> cool. What about you? <laughs> Intelligence levels? Um, so I actually had a really hard time with this too. Okay. I do like a man that's smarter than me where I can turn yeah. off my brain. I love yes. that. I yes. love, love, and love like, that. like trust that they know. Yeah. I kind of yeah. like when men talk at me. I know that's like controversial, but I'm I like, it depends what it's about. Yeah, yeah. As long as it's not condescending, I'm yeah. like, yes, like tell me, like teach me. I love that. I love when someone's passionate enough to tell me about things. Like just cause like I yeah. like to do the dumb. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Absolutely. Um, I put PETA. Because he oh, yeah. is so, so smart and, and smart, so yeah. cunning, and he He's uses his always intelligence. Underestimated. Yes, exactly. Mm-hmm. Like I love the sneaky smart. Yes, you know, like it's like wait, he's brilliant, and yes. you don't realize. Um, I yeah, that is who I put. But I did have a hard time with this. I just love a nerd. Like, give me a nerd. Give yep. me a big old nerd. Yep, yep, yep. Gabby says an emotionally intelligent man, right? Yes, there. yes, one hundred percent. Gabby, he is so good. And blonde, so love him. Look at me, Bridget. Oh my god, you picked a blondie. <laughs> now, jock levels. All right, what jock level are you looking for, Chloe? So I put Ginny, M. F. and Weasley. Oh my god, because she's is, a badass. She is a badass. Yes, M. F. Or yes. And- I was thinking about it because I was like, I do want a Quidditch player. And I was going through all of them in my head. And I was like, Ginny's the only one that plays two positions at a top, top level. Yes. And she then becomes a professional Quidditch, Quidditch player, player. Yeah. for the Hollyhead Harpies. Like, she is 1,000% one of the best athletes in Harry Potter. And it's not spoken of about enough. Yes. And if I'm like, if I have a jock, period, I want to be like cheering on the best jock. In, like Taylor Swift in that Travis way, I oh, want Travis and it's Ginny Weasley. I want to, I want to wear the cute outfits to the games. I want to be in the press box. Like I want it all. Like I, that is my truth. So Ginny, MF, and Weasley. Noise. What about you, Christine? All right, mine. I put Ethan Holstrom as a joke, but I was kidding. I don't want it to be taken seriously. Ethan Holstrom <laughs> is too, too jock. <laughs> He's not smart enough. Uh, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Really, it's Jace Wayland. I think you all knew, and I Megan said Jace Wayland, Jace Harrodale yeah. immediately. Like Jace is my jock level. I'm obsessed with what he can do. He's so talented, and I find it so attractive. How good he is at murdering people and flipping over shit. <laughs> I'm so attracted. And jumping to really murder. high. <laughs> If you're a murderer, slide into Christine's DMs. No. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he slays demons and bad Okay, people. so if you murder demons. Okay. That is hot. It's really hot. <laughs> I love Chase. I put Cassian. Oh. Okay. That's a good one. He's a big, big jock, though. Oh, but here's the thing. He's a smart jock. He 
also is very gentle. Yes. Mm. Especially if someone is in a very deep, dark place and yes. they haven't He's really very done a lot. Very understanding. Okay. It also pushes you to like, and he knows your limits. And I <laughs> think... He's very like, respectful. Oh, very respectful. He's very respectful. I see that. And like, if I, you know, if I've always wanted someone who I could like go do stuff with and like, they would just teach me and tell me like what to do. Yes. I'm like, okay, cool. You want and someone see, I can who see tells you what Jace. to do. Like he can yes. show me how to use whips <laughs> and weapons and stuff. <laughs> I'm being so dirty this episode and I can't stop it. Everything Natasha says, I'm like, oh my Ooh. God. Katie said, I feel like we're sleeping on Zayden Ryerson. And yeah, Zayden's hold so up, hold, up. hold on. Yeah, just hold He's up. He's coming. So now we're talking about special skills and when i say special skills i'm not talking about magic because we have a magic category so special skills is anything that's not magic that's their special skill in my opinion so my special skills are that of daniel from part of your world by abby jimenez he is like a carpenter boy artist he's like builds everything i want a man that's gonna be able to build me like a library <laughs> like customized bookshelves oh and whatever you went weird down that way route. that i want yeah i find that Wait, so that's hot. really yeah. sweet yeah. yeah when a man can like put stuff together for you your carpenter slide into christine's and, like, dms are creative <laughs> like <Jesus>. creatives <laughs> jesus literally. but only if he had short hair <laughs> Yeah, so if you haven't read Part of Your World, he's like a carpenter boy, like one of your classic love interests, but he's very creative, and he makes like art pieces too, and I love that, and he's very gentle and smart and funny, and I love him, so, and he loves dogs. So, special skills, who went last here? Someone hit me with You one. go, boo-boo. Zayden Ryerson. Oh, Ooh. I love that. I'm glad. <laughs> He's coming. He's here. I told you he was here. What special skill are you referring to? Murder? Sex? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I was going to say strategy. Mouth? Gabby says <laughs> mouth. Just kidding. So, no, 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 no. Okay. That and also, like, like this he... This episode is explicit. Oops. Uh, not, not tying. tying. <laughs> not tying. He worked on tying knots and iron and flame and he told her to work on it, too. He's listen. He's good at a lot of tactical things, and also um, he is. and like he's very clever. On a dragon in fighting is insane. It's hot. No, he's he's it's so hot. hot. Jace Whalen could yeah. say that too. Yeah. Just, so I mean, oh my God. <laughs> that's that, that, that's where I went. So his brain is really he's hot. He's so hot. No. And he's so I love how aware he is of like his toxicity. Sometimes he'll be like yeah, self aware. Don't bring up it. knots now, Megan's. I know. <laughs> I just edited that. I can't. I just read it out of my brain. <laughs> oh, Chloe, what's your talk? What's your special skills? So I play Ang for a spe- Aang? Aang. Oh. Fly? Yes, because oh I want to fly That's so my skill so too. badly. And Except I love in being in the air. Yes, and me too. I don't listen. know if that doesn't comment. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, Hi. sorry. Okay, we had a moment. But it's a martial art, technically. Yes. Bending is a martial art, not a magic. So I genuinely think that I don't know, Aang would just be so fun to be around and to fly with him. Like that sounds so fun. Uh so that's that. that's my special skill. Yes. All right, so we've got all our special skills. Okay, I want to know how serious is your man? Like, what's the serious level? Because mine is Will Herondale, so it's not very serious. But some of you like serious people. She's really into Will Herondale. I am. Oh. You should just put uh, him. He's a lot of I Will Herondale. I yeah. think I only doubled down like twice. I'm sorry, I doubled down a lot on Herondales. We know that they're my ultimate book boyfriend. I put Mr. Darcy. Mm. He's so serious. He's so serious. But you know what? But he opens up. He opened to one person. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like he's serious, but silly with one human. And I think that that's. And it's so sweet. And it's just like so sad. Curmudgeon vibes. Yeah. (laughs) He's like feisty, but like. Mm. All right. No, I think feisty is the right word. Yeah. 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 All right. Strong willed. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like him. (laughs) All right. You know what? Mr. Darcy's hot. Come on. You haven't watched the movie since you were like 12. Um, Try 21. Okay. (laughs) That's like, ten sounds years like ago. that around. Sounds like we need to do a movie commentary. <laughs> <gasps> yes. All right, Chloe. So serious level. Sokka. I'm like really <gasps> hitting y'all I with the avatar. Oh it's my God. really, I'm really with Sokka. me too. Yeah. Me too. And I almost put him for humor, but I yeah. actually I put him down for serious because he is so 
so funny yeah. the majority of the time but when yeah. he's about to go into battle or when he's planning strategy or when he's training like with the sword he, with my the brain sword. is I so love that scene no me All too right. yeah, yeah, yeah. but he is serious then he knows when to be serious you were talking about toxic like Will toxic... knows when to be serious too okay i'm happy for I'm you we know we get, you... <laughs> <laughs> we get it um yeah but he knows when to be serious and he knows when to be silly and i think that's the perfect amount for me like yeah. i need someone to get with the program when it's no, yeah. when we're not having a good time i have the toxic trait of silliness so he yeah. probably my guy does yeah, not yeah. know when to be serious yes. <laughs> but i don't mind it <laughs> i think Sokka grows into it though Sokka, i don't think he's always he does. yeah he does all right we're getting down to it now okay wit and banter we kind of touched on this but i want the wit and banter of one of my own characters pilot pen from a gamba <laughs> better i created How is that him fair what do you mean? She's like, I'm an author. I'm an author. I think I'm allowed. I'm like, uh, He's a fictional My third person. book's about to come out. Uh, it's whatever. Oh, my God. I forgot in the news. There's a book coming out May 21st called Attached at the Hip. I did it on it's, purpose. It's a rom-com, and you should pre-order it. Um, it's an adventure rom-com, a Survivor spinoff. It's so fun. I wrote it. I'm an author. Hi, my name is Christine Ruggio. I write books. Book coming out May 21st, 2024. I write books. <laughs> I write book. Please peer your order. I love you. Thank you. All right. So Pilot Pen is oh, a character banter. from my first book. And I agree. The banter that I have in there with him, I just always get so giddy <laughs> reading it. And I get so embarrassed that I wrote it. <laughs> <laughs> I love that, though. It's so cutesy sometimes. Yeah. It's beautiful, though, that you're so proud of it that Thank it would you. make your list. I think that actually is really amazing. I mean, I love a lot of the bit. I like my favorite thing to write in my books is banter. banter. Yeah. yeah, it's the best. Yeah. All right, what about you guys? Banter levels. I have one that you have, Charlie from Book Lovers. Oh yeah, he's his great. banter is so <sighs> so Top good. Notch. Emily Henry. Banter. Yes, I agree. Mm -hmm. Emily Henry in general, her banter is chef's kiss i do think it's similar from book to book yeah but um i but that's okay that's, it's amazing but it's so. amazing I'm so i'm like eating it up i'm yeah. like <laughs> more <laughs> that was some uh ASMR. 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 i hope you i hope that you enjoyed charlie could get it he could it, I he does like, get it i put down captain hook from once upon a time <gasps> oh Mm. he's so good so it doesn't really make sense with like mr darcy's seriousness because captain Hook is very like gregarious and charismatic yeah, it kind of cancels each other it out it does cancel it but i feel like he's he's serious maybe like every once in a while he gets in a captain hook mood yeah Ooh, okay yeah. Yeah. yeah yeah but like but like he can really turn it on yeah like, hey, he yeah can turn hold on and thick yes. hold on yeah i i like that and i want you to name your character we're at the point where he needs a name Oh, give us a name. Give us a name. <laughs> what? I haven't thought of what. I'm just, not prepared. Just spit it out. Give us one on the spot. What's his name? Okay, this is so weird. What river came up for me? Oh my god, your guy is such a hippie. <laughs> river, river run. Yeah. All right. I don't know. I think River's got long hair. Ri yeah, no. River's got River's got like, River he's can a air bend. A River can air bend. He's got long hair, daddy issues. Yeah, we like it. He's smart. Yeah. Hon wait, honestly, I know this he's man. A no, no, no. You guys, you guys. I know this man. I was like making this. I know someone exactly like this in real you life. You know River? I know. No, I don't. Like, I his name's not River. I know that. But I, I know get that. the guy. <laughs> but no yeah, it was this man in college that like I was like just deeply in love with, oh and God. he never I liked also me back. Know Will Herondale, and I have the same thing. I, oh. so one day we'll be with them. <laughs> one day we'll find one day. a real one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know anyone who is like anyone. Maybe one person. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, this got a little serious. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I'm going to name my character. Okay, well, you need to pick What's one. a hot name? We need to be able to call our characters things now because they become people. I can't believe I picked a river. My name coming up right now is Pendulum, which is That's not, not a name. name. Not a name. Not a name. Why is Rock coming into rock. my... Okay, Natasha's <laughs> gonna... Wait, <laughs> I'm River, you're Rock. <laughs> Oh no. Oh okay, yours God. has to be Nate Fern. I can do Fern. Fern? I can okay. do Fern. 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 River. Rock. Rock. River. River. They all are from the PNW. 
<laughs> what's what's that? Yeah, have you seen Christine's a sediment? <laughs> <laughs> I like Fern. What is the actor's name? Rock Hudson. That's oh, that's what happened. He's hot. <laughs> mm-hmm. I don't know. That's why his name's Rock. Is it Kate Hudson's son? What? No, son? He's no, he's actor old. From the Wait, 40s, 50s. is he Kate Hudson's f- no, dad? No, no. <laughs> no. Is he related to Kate Listen Hudson. Listen, the Nepo baby <laughs> uh, thing. Rock Hudson didn't have children. He was gay. All right, we're moving on. We've got our banter levels. We've got names. Natasha, what are Rock's eyeballs like? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, did I write that down? Chloe, what are River's eyeballs like? Oh, I didn't write it down. Oh, okay. no, 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 go, go, go. Give it to us. I put Thor. One eye? He's got one blue. fake eye, one real? Oh shit! He has an eye patch. Wait, I kind of. Oh, wait, I like that. that. Yes, he has one. Oh, and he can rock an eye patch yeah. every once in a while. <laughs> I forgot that he doesn't sexy. have an eyeball anymore. Sexy. I think eye patches are sexy. Oh I'll my say God. it. Man with eye patch from Lost. <laughs> Hot. Yeah. Hot. He loves me with only one eyeball. Oh. He loves you with <laughs> an eyeball. <laughs> Does your sight change when you only have one eyeball? Your depth perception. Why are you looking at that? What's happening? And Natasha's over here twitching uh, and trying well, to act. She's see, trying I to. I, my peripheral is gone. But oh yeah, you're just in my. That's but you still me. have your. Pulse. Are you loving her with one eyeball? <laughs> she, yes. she, she's eyeing me with, <laughs> Chloe, with one eyeball. What are your eyeballs like? River. Okay, this is a basic bitch answer, but I'm gonna say Percy. Oh, green. Your eyes sea are blue green. like green. the Caspian They're sea. sea green. Yeah, I know, but oh, dude, I was quoting blue. the mo- Whatever, I was quoting the book. Movie, oh. whatever. No, it, no there's sea green in the book. No, I know, but okay. Medusa. You guys are green. They are green. So are mine. So are mine. mine. We're the green eye girls. Whoa. Yeah, that's only wait, that's kind of crazy. Yeah. Isn't green like the most the, rare? Yes. Green? I thought blue people blue have the most recessive gene. Two percent of people have only green okay, eyes. Is it like zero percent have blue? No, blue, no, no. Blue, blue is, is more, more common. More common. What? We're rare. Yeah, <laughs> green is rare. I mean, I think the most like rare is like <laughs> lavender or <laughs> yeah. heterochromia. Love is half blind. Twenty-seven <laughs> percent of the population has blue eyes. Are you shitting That's me? That's a lot. That's so much. Okay, basic. Wait, are you kidding? Is three percent real for green eyes? It's two percent. Are you? Is it real? Who said that? Was it the government? Was it like the official world world census? I can Google it. Science. Two percent of the world has green eyes. What? We're just two percent. Uh, we're we're two all two percent. Yeah. Wild. I, we're stunning. That's what Wild. it is. Okay. Oh, my eyeballs. I didn't say. I'm gonna take Jay Swaylin's gold eyeball. Yeah, yeah. The gold is really next mm-hmm. level. Yeah. I thought about gold first, but then I was like, nah. Fern has gold eyes. <laughs> Fern has gold eyes. You would think green, but gold. So we could be green and gold. All I keep thinking about is the real life river and how bad I want him and how I never will. <laughs> oh my God. Aww. Tragic. Oh, sad. Shots says gold eyes would scare me, not going to lie. True. I, you know, and Edward also has gold eyes. Like, I'm oh. into those golden eyes. Only, but his I, golden I, eyes I don't only come. like his gold eyes to come. I only like gold <laughs> eyes on Edward mm. in in number one in twilight mm. but also if you think about gold eyes you know also is gold eyes? Is the, the witcher, witcher. except they're, they're fucking ugly creepy. yellow like, yeah those are scary those are not gold they're yellow yeah. yeah gold does give animal vibes well though. gold can give like like brown eyes like there's yeah. brown eyes that look oh, gold totally. yeah, yeah totally. they're like amber they're like so amber yeah pretty. i like I that a lot it's beautiful that's one of the prettiest yeah. Yeah. eye colors for sure yeah. and it's so homey you kind of mm-hmm. like want to sink into it all right we're on to magical skills. What magical skills do River and Rock have? Mine's really yes. Give it. Give it. <laughs> Give it. I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. I'm what embarrassed. is it? But it's my truth. It's my what truth. What is it? Is it sex? Snape. Skills? What? No. Here Potions? No. Defense against is, the dark art. Snape is genuinely one of the most talented wizards yep. in the wizarding world. I period. This. He's so powerful, and I love that he can also he fly can read is it because minds. he can fly he can fly he can read minds he can he's fly. an incredible he potion fly. master <laughs> <laughs> he's incredible at defense against the dark arts he is talented yeah i don't want anything else about him except but his talent his talent steal that magic talent i want i want him and to use his talents for river. me you know what i mean river river like is a little snape like he's long hair yeah he can make you the lucky potion so you can have it every once, every time. Oh, yeah, you mm-hmm. exactly. Like, no, Snape is talented. Felix Felicis. <laughs> I would kill for some of that. I would right too, now. Please. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Natasha. 
magic skills? The Darkling. Ew. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because it's fucking hot. Ew, his darkness? Yes. Well, I like Zayden's darkness better than his darkness. And his Hasha likes him a little evil. I she like likes them a little evil. evil. They're That's so okay. creepy. He has like demon shadows. I don't know. That's I kind of okay. I kind of get it. Like again, he uses I, I'm not If he uses make his him... power for you. Yes, Rock is not going to be an extreme villain because I have I have a, a he's going to have Anti-hero. an event. Anti-hero. He's going to have an event. Oh. That'll be a It'll tie it, it. It'll be a redemption arc. Okay. Okay. I like the redemption okay. arc. She does love she the does like that. Fic. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she does. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. Yeah, you do. <laughs> I do. <laughs> so do I, girl. <laughs> All right. For me, I want Fern to have the magical skills of Mrs. Weasley. Ooh. I want him to be able to clean our house really well. You want to stay at home, husband? <laughs> <laughs> oh Christine, Fern, stay at home. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, no, he doesn't have to stay at home because it's fast for him to do it because he's good at the magic, right? So she wants a slave. <laughs> Excuse no. me, I just want him to be able to clean the house because I'm, I, I've am i grown up around men who don't do any cleaning. Oh, and I find it really okay. hot when men clean. Yeah, mm-hmm. no, it is hot. Because I do all the cleaning when I'm around men and I fucking hate it. I'm sorry for what I said. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> oh, it's not slavery when women do it. <laughs> True. No, I, th- I, I think so too. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> I like cleaning for the other person when the other person doesn't do cleaning. Yeah. yeah. That is not okay. Yeah. 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 But if he has cleaning skills where he could like spell the cleaning. Yeah. No. And that'd Amazing. be really nice. So we could both do things together while the cleaning is cleaning itself. True. Mary Poppins. Oh. I would love Mary Poppins. But Molly, but Mo- Molly Weasley can is also, also rear your children. Snap. And the job's a game. Yeah. Oh my God. I fucking love that scene. Mary Poppins. Yeah. I always want to snap and clean stuff. I would love cleaning if I did that. Yeah, same. I mean, I love the act of cleaning. Me too. I really like to clean. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> I would love cleaning if it was snapping. I told and them. watching stuff clean itself. That's true too. <laughs> That's fun. Last night, I told them because I everyone's here in my apartment. And Alex, for my 30th birthday, also his 30th birthday, um, bought me one of those like intense steam cleaners. <laughs> Grown that, like, ass woman gift. A 30-year-old <laughs> birthday gift. Well, I got a I vacuum. Got a- cleaner for my 30th birthday for my mom a rumba oh, wow. it was a really nice rumba can yeah. i can i make a request yeah in five years please don't buy me a vacuum <laughs> <laughs> you'll see what you feel in five years yeah. <laughs> anyways i started cleaning at midnight last night and i was just like <laughs> <laughs> and then we got a text i'm speed cleaning <laughs> hobby do you want them oh. to have whoa 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 what you're skipping stature we are oh fuck i put oh, stature, stature. In, the, in the different spot for myself okay do stature okay i googled it because i want a tall man uh, so i was what like is that called oh. tall <laughs> so i put emmett cullen oh he's six Ooh. five canonically oh and he's big nice. six yes, five and is. big so i said I want to the dream. Okay, the dream is a tall girl, and all you right. get this. I'm, you're tall too. We're all tall. We're all tall. Yeah, yeah. yeah. She's like, Ish. I'm trying to be on my tippy toes with like a cramp in my neck. I'm trying to look way up. See, I had that. It hurts. <laughs> and that's yeah, hot. John was very tall. It's How so tall, tall was he? He was six, six. four. Hot. <laughs> hot. Anyways, Emmett Cullen, because he can throw me around, and I can look up at him. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and I love that. Yeah, I will Herondale classic oh my goodness. shocker <laughs> this is like quadruple down <laughs> she should have just put will Heron sorry down. i was th- between him and jay's fern is will will is fern <laughs> fern has a lot of similarities to will <laughs> nicole dated a six nine guy holy Hot. shit oh my Lord. that's so how tall, tall are you nicole, yeah, get, nicole, nicole are you like tall girly <laughs> But Will Herondale could throw me around, and he's very, like, he can dance. He mm. can, he's got moves. Okay, yeah, Natasha. Um, Superman? Duh. Oh, duh. Oh. Duh. duh. Henry Cavill? Is this your double down? Sorry, who? This Nicole's 5'6". Right. Wow. He's over a foot taller. Nicole, no, but Nicole's still, like, pretty tall for a woman. Yeah. So I'm okay. I'm just 
Can I say something controversial? No. Okay. Say I know it. what you're going to say. What? Okay, no, no, I, I want to hear it. it. I'll keep it in my pants. You have to say it. I just don't think that like five women that are five feet should be dating men that are six, four and above. I agree with that statement. Okay. They're allowed to date whoever they want. No, in well, platform shoes. Right. But I'm allowed to be upset about it. <laughs> As someone who's five nine. <laughs> I'll give you NBA babies. Don't you want that? Yeah. I don't know why I looked at you like that. Dead in the eye. You want NBA babies? You want my Come babies, Christina? <laughs> My mom today, as I was leaving to drive here, goes, Chloe, <laughs> when are you giving me babies? What? I'm leaving the house. <laughs> no Not contact. Right now. <laughs> Zero contact. <laughs> when are we having babies? I think she looked at your outfit and she goes, oh, you look really no, good. No, she, she you did look think really I looked festive. really cute. <laughs> the, a man in the grocery store said I looked festive this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. All right. So... You said Superman. Superman. All right. So, and you said Emmett. Emmett. And I said Will Herndale on brand. All right. Rock and River. They're going to be besties. Honestly, Rock and River. Fern is going to roast them all the time. We kind of have similar (laughs) types. Yes, we do. Natasha and I kind of have similar types. You're over there in No Man's Land. Yeah. No Man's Land. I'm in the library. I am in the library. To be fair, actually, I think Christine's type is probably more typical. The book boy? Yeah, yeah. Book boy is my type. Book boy. Yeah, it's book very boy. hard to find what we book like. Book boy yeah. who's also athletic, though. So it's a little bit yeah, of that's a... That's true. Yeah, yeah, duck, yeah. Duck, duck, goose there. Mm. <laughs> no ducks, though. I love ducks. And herondales. <laughs> I'm an anomaly. <laughs> the next thing on our left thing is hobbies. So what kind of hobbies are you looking for in Rock and Fern? I mean, Rock and River. I put, I put down Iron Man again. Yeah, those are good hobbies. I, I yeah. just want him to be tinkering with things. I love that. No, yeah, no, I yeah, love yeah. It. And what I, about you, Chloe? Yeah. A. Ron Weasley again, actually. Ron, Beca- Ron, Ron Weasley. Weasley. <laughs> what does Ron do? Uh, chess? Wizard's chess. Wizard's so chess. So I'm a, I'm a board game. I am oh, a board game girl. I love that. I love board games. Like, I'm deep. That's actually deep perfect. in board games. I love that. Yeah. yeah, thank you. And I couldn't think of someone who was, like, more into board games than, than, Ron, Weasley. than Ron Weasley. Mm. Like, and also, if you're into board games slide into my dms okay great i want dorian Havilliard's hobbies he's from a throne of glass what is he he's a book boy so he loves reading he loves sword fighting and Mm. ice and ice ice well like like the concept of hobbies is learning how to wield his ice powers like elsa okay oh he has ice powers well that's not a hobby. That's a magic, <laughs> and you can't have that. Well, it's just a hobby. Not a hobby. It's not a hobby. Not a not, hobby. It's not his main thing. It's not his main mm-hmm. shtick. Now you have you have double. Ma- you can't have All cleaning right. magic and sword and ice fighting. Magic. Okay, cleaning Reading magic was an interesting fighting. one to put yes. top. You're like, I need them to clean, and that's my priority. <laughs> it is in a relationship. I want cleanliness. Valid, no, valid, valid, cleanliness. Valid. Okay, so his hobbies are reading and sword fighting. Okay. 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 We like that. Megan said Dorian is also kinky. I like that. What kind of kinks? I don't remember. Reading? Suddenly I'm intrigued. Wait, don't say anything. <laughs> no, no, don't say anything, but I'm intrigued. Okay. Flirt levels. How flirty is your man? Again, this is going to cancel out the whole seriousness aspect what? of it. What are you going to say? I'm putting, I put Captain Hook again. <laughs> because Captain, again. Rock can, contains multitudes. He's Rock layers. Conta- he's yes. an onion. Layered. <laughs> and then if you watched, um, Shrek. If you watched Once Upon a Time <laughs> and there's episode at the end of season four. The end of season four. <laughs> where they go back in time. Where did this come and from? And rewrite history. <laughs> Anyways, she, Emma Swan, has to interact with this version of Captain Hook, um, and she has to, like, kind of... Like, like an alternate version from No, no, history? his past version, his past self, and she has to interact with his past self, and he's like, he's like, just lay it on thick, like, distract me so I can go get this thing. So his future self is watching his past self. And the, so she, like, approaches him at this, like, bar, or canteen whatever it's called back then um and he is a so tavern? flirty he's just like I don't know. <laughs> what one more time the face that she's Natasha doing like is an open mouth this face with hook. a finger out in a hook <laughs> it's hot it's certainly hot anyway <laughs> he's very flirtatious 
and I would be into it. And he and he is not he doesn't he doesn't hold things back. Yeah. He lets you know and I need that. I need mm. that like assurance. I don't yeah. like games. I need the assurance up front. I get that. I am a flirter, okay? All right. Yeah, you've been flirting with me all day. I know. And it's been fun. Have you liked it? Yes. I I'm the girl that I'll send the rinse I'll send the risky text every time. Oh, I'll the send the risky, the risky text, text every time. Yeah. I draft. I'm the ghostwriter for my girlfriend's text oh, wow. when yeah. they're flirting yeah. with people. Like yeah. I love to flirt, and I'm damn good at it. Okay. Okay. I need someone to be there with me at that right? level. We yeah. need to be at the same level. I love to sext. I need someone that's also a good sexter. Like it's important to me, genuinely. Um, Zayden. Zayden comes in here for me. He, yeah. the way that he flirts in his mind yes, with yeah. violence, it. like it is. I love it. It so is much. so good. Yeah. Like, I think honestly, it's he's hot. the only man that could his mind keep up with me. Is so hot. Yeah. Wait, so I, well, I feel like you, you're gonna need Zayden in the special skills or magic because you need his mind talk. That's true. But he could you also do. he could also talk flirt. Like, he could also use his voice. Yeah, he could also <laughs> use his voice to flirt. Yeah. Yeah, like he he's doesn't good do at it, it as much, but he does do it. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Mm. But it's really good when they're like together. It is. Mm. You, have you guys seen the memes? It's just them staring at each other, ta- but they're having a fight uh-huh. because they they don't <laughs> yeah. talk out loud. Yeah, <laughs> so it's just like Aylan and people Rowan. are just watching them watch each other. Yeah, yeah. I love it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and Bryce does that with Rune and Hun. <laughs> mm-hmm. All right, for me, my flirt levels are Will. <laughs> oh my god. I need you to okay. spice this up. Okay. We can't Can you have like Will be Ariel creative? the entire time. <laughs> I'm bored. Oh, fuck. Something else. I'm bored. <laughs> okay, well, I put Rice Sand as my second, but I feel like I would die because he's, like, really intense. And I could only handle so much before I melt away into a puddle. <laughs> okay, I love so, that, though. So you would not be able to do, like, the leaning thing. What leaning? The like door. The, 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 I, I yeah. Oh, I would immediately make fun um, of him. Like that oh. would be my that would be my reaction. I'd immediately I'd be like, I'd be like, yeah. I'd be like, what are you doing? Like, like when men flirt heavy with me, I just laugh in their face because <laughs> I'm like, what are you oh my doing? God. <laughs> These poor men. I remember we were at this party and this one guy like said something about like, like some like line about me being pretty, and I was just like. <laughs> Oh my god, Christine. Wait, what party was this? I'll tell you later. <laughs> was I there? Yes. Oh, I will okay. tell you okay, later. Fine. I will tell tea you time? later. Tea time? And they were like, what? <laughs> when I left their face. Woof. Woof. I would, my ego bruised if that happened to me. <laughs> Owie. I yeah. can't handle it. Big owie. Because to me, it just almost feels disingenuine when, like, it's so heavy and I've seen them flirt with other people. Oh, I'm just that's, like, don't no, that's even gross. with me. Yeah, if, that is, yeah. If you're heavy flirting with me, though, at just me, oof. That, okay, that's where the Mr. Darcy seriousness comes yes, in. The because curmudgeon. it's only me. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. But, like, a lot of flirters are flirting with, like, you. everybody, you know, because they like to flirt. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So you kind of like it's no, it's a unicorn I trait to only in have someone's that face if they always flirt. Like I don't see them always flirt, but I just know from yeah. their personality mm-hmm. that they always flirt. Yeah, but you get to knock them down a peg. Yeah, no, I, I like that. See, when I like dated a guy with a big ego, like I liked him, yeah. but like I could tell like he thought a lot of himself, so I was just constantly making knocking fun him down of him a little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. And some I, men need that. A lot of men need that. Like when you have a license plate that says your job on it. Yeah, I can't not make make fun of that <laughs> and i'm sorry <laughs> no that's valid but like there's a lot of little things like that that i just thought were hilarious because it was like over the top i just realized that my ex had a really big ego while you were talking got a big ego <laughs> you made me realize someone got christine an author license plate like author with a forest <laughs> no <laughs> please <laughs> Do you want your guy to be shy? No, that's it. Me either. Yeah. No. no. Yes, but not around me. <laughs> oh, you want him just to talk to Rock you? Only talk to <laughs> Natasha. I want Rock him silent in front of he, other people. He, here's it. He does Rock, it. No he, he's a man of few words. <laughs> no, that's hot. That's hot. That's I hot. Hate and that. he's and, he, and a little and he evil. Picks his words Wisely. carefully and doesn't embellish. And speaks when he wants to speak, and it's always poignant. See, I want a chatty. 
boy. Yeah, I want him yappy. I want to talk I yap all the time about yeah, that's everything. Fine. When we're comfortable, it's easy going. But like when we're around, oh, around other people, yeah. you don't want him to. You want to be the yapper. Yes. Yeah. Okay. I want to be like equal yaps. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah I guess equal yaps. Equal nice. yaps. I don't talk as much. Like you guys are definitely overpowering me today, and that's okay. Yeah. So I okay. say my things when I need to. We're both. Okay. Heavy yappers. We yap. We yap. I like to talk. Tiffany says, Christine and Natasha, it's clear y'all are BFFs because your times are so opposite. <laughs> so real. Chloe over here. We're, we're, we're the same. same. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Your your boy can shapeshift. Okay. What can they shapeshift into? Oh. Wait, rock? I thought- Does he shapeshift into a rock? No. Wait. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was like, can shape shift into vampire or a werewolf no those were separate categories okay well oh yeah my that... man's cannot shape shift well he can't he into can, a, but a what werewolf. Is it? into werewolf. a werewolf ew yeah. you want a werewolf yeah i like him hairy all right what do you want natasha i didn't think about this i'll go my guy can shape shift into a hippogriff so we can fly around yeah. love all the time that's a good oh. that's a good one yeah it's a really good one yeah that's where i getting my fly fix dragon with maybe burn. i don't want a dragon because then he could like set me on fire really easily and murder me if he wanted to i don't like that okay my guy's gonna shape shift into like a jaguar like like, like like a cat and then if i need to like be a prote- jungle cat yeah if i need to be protected he'll just sleep on the end of my it bed. is a sexy animal in from blood and ash by Jennifer L. Armantrout, there's some shapeshifters and they and they shapeshift into like big cats. And I like that. Like oh, okay. they're like saber tooth things. I love that. Mm-hmm. Sophie to, a wants her. a merman to take her underwater. You can just have Rosie Jackson. You Ooh. don't need to have a guy with a tail or but, a waterbender. Or Therian Pettos. She Pettos. likes the kink of the mermaid. Maybe she tail. does. Yeah. No, sorry. That's I hot. wasn't thinking about that. I was just thinking about my love for Percy. It blinded me. How do you have sex with a merman, though? Oh, I. Oh, I. Did I tell you? You told me they just like. Wait, I just imagined them swimming around each other, and I just kept that image, even when you told me. No. So <laughs> tell me. We. I went to a mermaid um, romance book. Signing, yeah. Sure. And the question was, how do people have yeah. sex? No, I'm dying to know. And. Like if okay, this is weird. If you've ever seen dolphins, mm-hmm. and it just it just comes out, yeah, that's big it. slinging penis. Yeah. Oh yeah, we talked about this. Yeah. yeah, yeah, we did. Thank you, thank you for the education. You're welcome. So vampire, yes or no? No, no, me either. I said yes. <laughs> No, that checks. That checks for rock. It checks 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 for rock. Rock is going to suck your blood during sexy times like true blood. (laughs) Okay. That if also the main thing about vampires is that they're cold and you know what I am mm. always boiling. Oh, yeah, so yeah, yeah, yeah. I like a, I see a that. nice low temperature person. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah. 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 Okay. yeah. Mm-hmm. What about you, Chloe? You don't know, right? No. Okay, werewolf. You said yes. Yeah, I want to ride on his back. Are you kidding me? So werewolves have temper issues a lot of the time. I like temper. I guess. Okay. Is, is he an alpha? Yeah, he's an alpha. Does he have oh, the knot? Gross. He has the knot. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> the way I almost stuck out my tongue just now was really gross, and I'm so sorry no, for not. who's watching. Um, no, I'm not necessarily into the knot, like, yeah. but I am into the idea of an alpha werewolf, and I want to cuddle with a werewolf. But I'm allergic to dogs, so I'm wondering if that's a problem. It like, am I allergic to werewolves? Shots. It's the dander. It's the dander. It's the dander. <laughs> But maybe they're humans. Yeah, it's uh, fine. Who knows? Well, it's Human okay. dander's fine, right? At the end of the day, he's not real. So, so there you go. <laughs> Did you ever have you ever read the knot in the book? No. Okay. So well, I Chad says Chloe likes temper and Natasha likes temperature. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh my god. Elise says her man turns into a panda. <laughs> Wait, I love that. Oh, that Wait, so cute. pandas are like rich. And they're so cute. What do you what do you mean the bears? <laughs> they're going extinct. No, I just mean like they're rare. So like they're like we buy pandas on lease in America for a lot of money. So they're like rich. This is weird. We borrow pandas from China. Did you not know this? Well, they're not rich themselves. No, no, they're the pandas bears. are. But it's like, like bouge. Like I don't know. Okay, I'm sure they have a bougie air. Yeah, they have bo- like mm. pandas they're are so bougie. Silly. Like I love when they roll down hills. Because they're silly. Aww. That's so true. That's it's so cutie. So cute. Baby pandas, so but, cutie. But like, then I'd be embarrassed if my boyfriend fell down a hill as a panda. And I'd be, mean, get up! <laughs> it's giving red from Pixar. <laughs> Would that give you the ick? 
see it would give me that because I want my boyfriend to be athletic so I'd be like get up (laughs) get on your feet on your feet (sighs) oh my god all right so where were we oh werewolves and okay so Faye no no No. me neither absolutely not (laughs) Faye can be such assholes no big x no okay like okay can see dead people yes or no I kind of have a deep answer to this oh tell me i think i uh, yes yeah because i don't know my birth- you want to talk to yeah i yeah. don't know i don't know my birth mom because yeah, i was thinking there could be like lots of interesting answers to yeah, this. yeah i don't know my birth mom and she died when i was six and i like remember aspects of her but not her or who she was yeah and i would love 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 to talk to her so definitely like a yeah. selfish reason but um yeah i think that do you think that after would- a while like him seeing dead people all over the place would start to scare you or no Mm, it might <laughs> it certainly might because what if they were like in your i didn't room? think that far i was just like surface level mom you yeah. see i've yeah i've read ninth house so that's what i was thinking about okay no dead people no dead people i no necromancy that's it, yeah it, just, it always gets into like iffy there's gets, like very sweet a things weird you can, yeah you can do a thing about, but then like there's like so much talk more via like what uja board ouija board ouija board oh i didn't talk about my stature Oh yeah, oh. I did Will Herndale. But yeah. like I, I had wrote athletic enough to pick me up and do acro yoga with me. So that's <laughs> acro yoga. Yo- no, I want to do acro yoga. <laughs> stunts. <laughs> like you want to do stunts? <laughs> like cheerleading stunts. Okay. With my acro yoga boyfriend. <laughs> okay. Named Fern. <laughs> Yo, Herndale. Fern would do acro <laughs> yoga. Yes, he would. There's that a would Fern a out there doing acro <laughs> yoga right now. <laughs> we didn't put down mating bond. Oh, why would we put that down? You want to have the mating bond? No, I want that. No, she does because she wants everything to be just her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I see that. I see that. I I want a mating bond. I mean, it would be funny to talk to each other in our brains because of the mating bond. Mating bonds don't have to always be that. It could be the knot. Yeah. No. (laughs) No knots for me, please. I think you would have a mating bond, actually, because you feel so deeply. Would you date someone who was a thousand years old? Because I would say, no, fuck no. I need you to know my pop culture references. And you are not in with, oh. the, with the kids. And when I mean kids, I mean me. Because they're a thousand. <laughs> I, I don't really like the idea of someone being immortal and I'm not. I don't either. It freaks me out. You want it. <laughs> Chloe wants people, it. She likes to date oldies. Chloe, Chloe likes her men a little older. <laughs> A thousand sounds old no, no, enough. No, no. <laughs> no, a thousand's too old. I will Is say, it? a thousand's too old, but I'm thinking like. The okay, so, a so a thousand is like granddaddy, not daddy, and I'm I'm want daddy. You know, you know what I mean. You mean like an Edward a hundred? That's what I'm saying. I literally put one hundred and eight. Edward. Edward is like a hundred and four, like hot. Is he one hundred eight? It depends. And I think when. at the start, is yeah, he yeah. not one hundred four? He was one hundred eight. Um, that's like my perfect like 108 because it was well i guess he was born in 19 1918 girl i'm not doing math no he, he died in 19- i don't know what you're, no i'm not doing 19. math i just okay. think that it's hot that he's old I and would, i would yeah i would love to talk to river then because i i love history and like yeah i would love to talk to them yeah you want to be friends with river yeah okay yeah. you can totally be friends with river yeah me we can and all be will, homies i mean fern will <laughs> rock won't talk to us but he'll be there <laughs> Yeah, Rock will just sit in the corner on like an but he'll chair. Be, no, but he'll be staring, staring. at Natasha yeah. the whole time. <laughs> yeah. Raw sexual magnetism level. I have Damon Salvatore down. Ooh. Who do you guys have? Resand. Oh, nice. Zayn and Ryerson. Oh, fuck. They're okay, all, listen, listen. They are just attracting the world. I want Zayn and Ryerson biblically. Biblically. I want to call him daddy. I want oh. him to do vile things to me. And oh. then I want to ask him to do it again. Like, oh, okay. I want that man so bad this episode is so scandalous it's what did fine you think it was gonna fine. be i don't know i was thinking like i was literally imagining like cutting out like paper dolls and putting together a boyfriend i didn't i didn't say anything that bad just no then. you didn't you no. didn't i just it's said just, i wanted I it biblically you know it just sounds so scandalous compared to what i was picturing in my head like the 1930s like putting together a boyfriend oh oh oh, oh. no well, but no, obviously I'm it was never gonna be that that's you. just like my brain <laughs> So if he says, I love no, the spice. No, we love the spice. It's fun. Natasha and I are a little spicier. I'm definitely leaning towards the, like, what is the other side? You're fluffy. The floof? 
floof. You floof. like the floof. floof. Just, Just like, like his, his hair. hair. <laughs> oh. What kind of fashion does your man have? Oh, no, you go, because you made this face Go just ahead, then. Natasha. I like a man in a suit, Oh, but not a suit Are you talking that about you're suit thinking like of. Christian Grey? I'm thinking, like, Batman, <laughs> Kylo Ren. <laughs> you're telling me you want Rock to just Dread walk like around Batman. in a Batman suit? <laughs> no, okay, in my it's world, like this ben is... Wyatt in that one episode of Parks and like... <laughs> <laughs> in my fictional world this is a fantasy this is not real world natasha, natasha. in her living room do you want I to talk in, to you like I batman in gowns all the time love love and he but wants like, to rule the but, world but in his like armor. the batman suit is a different vibe than the gown it's like an armor no honestly i see it and i'm yeah. attracted to it yeah i like it a lot mm -hmm. no and then like the muscles on the suit yeah. hot okay and then his like normal attire is like Ren Fair chic love with like, like wait like towel. darcy yeah. yeah and darcy in a big the in a big floofy white shirt by day darcy, darcy by the night batman, batman. <laughs> oh, my oh my god so good oh boy what about you chloe mm. um i i this is so out of left field um but whatever we're already here rip from yellowstone y neither of you are yellowstone wait, 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 just like a cowboy is it, is it, is it who's does he wear a cowboy hat because this tracks for you one like. with a beard yes yes does he have a cowboy hat he does have a cowboy does hat he have jeans wow. with like one of those belts? yeah yeah okay. i like a cowboy i want a cowboy river makes with some sense. boots All river right. makes a lot of sense i've dated river all right um mm -hmm. i also want river the other river that mm -hmm. i didn't date um yeah so i love boots uh, i love the toxicity <laughs> um and i like shitty country music so yeehaw nice. my guy is going to have fashion like jack sparrow i thought she was gonna say well i heard for a second jack sparrow's better i love that wait with like eyeliner and everything he's gonna sometimes the dress. wear the guy liner but like he'll have like the 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 top with the thing and like it's basically a renaissance top he's it basically yeah. Is. Yeah, it's a yeah yeah top. yeah i love jack sparrow's outfit no, i think he's cool i think it's the coolest so fern and i are gonna do like acro yoga in his jack in sparrow his pirate outfit, outfit. <laughs> i love my do you think but that's... with but with with edward hair with edward hair <laughs> so but his hair is being covered by the hat well, no, he'll sometimes just wear like the bandana, like Jack wears. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's okay. hot. Those boots, you like really like the oh, Jack the boots. Sparrow boots. I love okay, the boots. If I if I saw a man wearing those, uh, I'd run. Yeah, <laughs> the other the way. Other way. <laughs> <laughs> have you ever seen, have you met Jack Sparrow at Disneyland yet? You know, I'm not as attracted to random Jack Sparrows as I am to so just Johnny the movie Depp. Jack okay. Sparrow. Well, that's a different experience for me when I see Kylo Ren in real life it's it's a whole it's all hot it's all hot yeah no no like, no it i mean sometimes Driver, the jack hot. sparrows Kylo are hot, hot. It, but sometimes they're not that's that's, that's what that's i mean true. Like, that's true you, you sometimes you, they can't pull it off yeah no it's valid yeah all right you pull off jack sparrow like thank you're you. hot in jack sparrow outfit. thank you i feel good in i jack think sparrow. i'm more attracted to you than jack sparrow in thanks. that outfit thanks yeah. I, I think so too. I would. Yeah, agree. yeah I yeah. love my jack sparrow cosplay. why did you wear that because we were supposed to wear pink and, and she's not wearing pink. pink. What? <laughs> okay, whatever. Well, that's the opposite. Blue and pink are the opposite. At least if he wore pirate gear, we'd be like, fun. We're, we're giving gender reveal. <laughs> <laughs> we are totally giving we gender reveal. We are giving such gender reveal. <laughs> What's it going to be? <laughs> We've got two left. All right. Ambition levels of give it to us. Daenerys Targaryen. <gasps> that is that crazy. Is sick. <laughs> that is crazy. But if she had a redemption arc, okay, I don't want her ending. Okay, at all, because it was but all for her ambitious. Out. It's still crazy. It was all working out for a while there. It was uh, all working out for a second. I am the Jon Snow in this. You scenario. do really want to rule the world. You I do. do. Yeah, I'm, I'm making. I'm making a villain story arc. 
yeah. definitely. Yeah, but you want we, you want to roll the. She's world. gonna do all the talking while Rock just. <laughs> yeah, no, Rock's the figurehead. <laughs> yeah, no, Rock is going to. Rock, Rock is the puppet he's behind not, the street. He's no, he he knows what he wants. I don't need to talk for him. He knows. It, I will just be there to fill in if he needs me oh, to. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. It's giving Lady rule. Macbeth. It's. Giving Mm-hmm. Yeah, so book, as Megan says, man. book Daenerys. Yeah, thank you, because we as we don't know her mm. end story there. In my world, it's like a space opery type thing, and um, he wants to rule the world, and I'll be there with him, looking okay. hot. Yeah, being his queen, mm-hmm. right. love. Okay, what about you? Fred and George Weasley. <gasps> I they love are that. So, They're so innovative, so ambitious, and innovative. And I'm gonna say it like Molly oh, doesn't really respect them. or appreciate yeah. it enough until they start making thinker. money. Yeah, yeah and I love that. I love the creative business brain. Yeah. Mm. All right. Well, mine is Hermione Granger. Wow. <laughs> Okay, she's chaotic with her ambition. She just, like, is so smart and always is looking for ways to do things that are ambitious that Mm -hmm. help people. Yeah. And I love that. And while she is ambitious, she always, I feel like, will put the people she loves above her career, which I love. And she's willing to break the rules for the people she loves. She's also sometimes crazy. I'm crazy. (laughs) Yeah, I know. (laughs) Perfect. She's cuckoo bananas. She is cuckoo bananas. Cuckoo <laughs> pollen bananas. <laughs> cuckoo pollen bananas twenty. <laughs> cuckoo polis bananas. <laughs> cuckoo team polis bananas. Go join our Patreon now. <laughs> All right. So last category is your meet cute. Tell us how you met River. How are you meeting? And what was it like? And we'll fill in some of the gaps of your story after your meet cute. Okay, so I recently had a meet cute with River. No, 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 no. My meet cute at the airport. <laughs> oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. You did, that's and I. It didn't work out, but I'm. I'll tell a little bit. It's on but TikTok. But I kind of. It is on TikTok. <laughs> at Chloe the, Laverson. Link to the show notes. Um, but I saw a cute guy at the airport we were making eyes at each other Mm -hmm. and he like talked to me a little bit while we were boarding the plane and he ended up sitting a row in front of me and he was so cutie and tall and I was like okay and I passed him a note it was so ballsy of me but I I passed him a note with my number and we went on a date and it was definitely just friends vibes he's still such a good person and he's so cute um but I want that to like actually work like how cute is that I passed him a note I was bold like I was so proud of my myself i was shaking the whole time and texting my friends i was like holy shit am i gonna do this but i did it and it was so fun so like i would love that sort of thing like maybe a note passing or um some sort of i don't know i'm a bold person and i kind of like the idea of me being the bold one yeah yeah i like that Mm. i've been the bold one yeah I do like how you get what you want sometimes. No, I agree. I totally Mm -hmm. agree. I just, I, I think that putting yourself out there, like I heard this, this is a common phrase, but fortune favors the bold Mm -hmm. and I've really been living that way and it has made a big difference. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love that. What about you, Natasha? I'm going to have the meet cute that Prince Charming and Snow White have. And if you don't know what it is it's um so snow is like from once upon a time yeah snow is um like a bandit at this point and she gets caught in one of um prince charming's like nets and gets like pulled up into the trees yeah uh because uh, i think he's looking for the oh she she stole something from him and so he's trying to get it back and so they meet that way and she's like in the net and she there's just a lot of cute banter back and forth and then she gives him back what she needs and then they go off on and have this little journey together um where they it's fight so the cute yeah it's so cute and romantic but i'm like oh that's how rock and i are going to meet <laughs> you're gonna get captured i'm gonna get captured by his net but then I have, but then he needs my help. Yeah. Love so, it. Love, love, love. Yeah. Nice. For me, what's going to happen is that we're both going to like be uh, in a bet from our friends, just like how to lose a guy in 10 days. Oh. And we're both going to be like kind of using each other, but actually like falling in love. Classic. And uh-huh. it's going to be so fun. Or we're both going to be sitting on a plane together, stuck next to each other for eight hours, which I also love. But maybe that's where it's it like, starts. It's like, can you keep a secret? 
yeah well maybe that's where it starts like i know him and then they make a bet and then we start using each other for the bets but also we love each other i like it i like it too yeah but yeah those are those are our orange our frankenstein boys they're beautiful frankenstein they're boys. really grand i think we did a really good job their names really do sound like they're all from seattle but yes it's okay. That's okay. <laughs> That's okay. Shot says Prince Charming turned super villain with the rest of the talking. Yes. Thing. Listen, he's going to be a villain for a second. I feel and like then, he's an anti hero. No? Yes. And then he's going to do the greater good. And like you, you think that he for is a, a villain second or for a whole you, book? You think that he's the villain, but he's actually the good guy. Mm. So, Rice and? Yes, I will fix him as Shot says. I will fix him. <laughs> that, that always works. Yeah. That always works. Because he's going to be like this loner for such a long time. And then the mating bond clicks into place. And I'm like, I'm here. Let me fix all your problems. Yeah. Yeah. That definitely Mm -hmm. happens in real life. Well, that was so much fun. (laughs) So much fun. Um, I love our boys. That's going to be our episode today. But first, we're going to do Mary Kiss Cliff before we sign off. Here we go. All right, Chloe, you put together American I book. did. Right? So I thought since we're making our book boyfriends, we could do book tropes. Okay. Um, but I picked ones that I know that are, I feel like are on the same playing fields because I wasn't going to pick brothers because the two of you would be all over that and I wasn't going to pick enemies to lovers because I know that we all love we that all love too that. Yeah. so it's bestie booze to lovers like best friends okay, to lovers like mm-hmm. um, I guess we should pretend to date oh yeah fake dating fake dating okay. and there's only one oh bed. my god what do we do we love there's <laughs> only one yeah. bed mm-hmm. okay I'm marrying there's only one bed okay and I'm doing, I'm going to kiss. I guess we should pretend to date. Okay. And then I'm going to cliff Bessie Boost to Lovers because sometimes it takes too long and I get really frustrated. Oh, you're not good with the slow burn? I am. You are? But sometimes it slow burns all the way to the final page and then that's they're like, true. we love each other and then it's over. Yeah, I'm like, that's we true. We need the scenes where they like actually get together yeah, and have yeah. their sex Agreed. 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 Or else it's not satisfying. Totally. Also, friends and lovers, like there's not enough like spicy connections mm. like the, sometimes, sometimes there is there are. it depends if they have like really sexual chemistry together mm. all the time that i love yeah and then true. they just don't act on it but like, i have been when traumatized it's just friends friends all the time i'm like eh. i've been traumatized by best friends to lovers happening in real life um oof. so but i do really like it sometimes yeah sometimes um, i do like, love it too i do like a harry hermione fic every once in a while you know yeah. um to cleanse the palate from Hermione. But I, I do think I agree. I think there's only one bed I'm marrying because there's nothing better. There's nothing there's better. There's literally than nothing one better. Bed. Brothers, there's only one, one bed. bed. <laughs> <laughs> We've done it. We've done yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> um, the summer I turned pretty. There's brothers. Yep, there's yep, only one yep. bed. Oh, yeah. And I guess we should pretend a date is my kiss. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I do love to all the boys I've loved before. I fucking love so it good. so much. It's perfect. I Natasha? Think I'm going to mary there's only one bed kiss i guess we should be pretend a date and we yeah, need to share it. fix that's yeah. what's happening that's what i'm hearing we've, we've got the same choices here for tropes it's okay <laughs> it's i okay. i was hoping no. that we might not but i i do think these are like sort of close yeah i, mean, I, yeah. I do like i guess we should pretend to date because that's that's like it's bridgerton fun. season one I yes like that. so yes that's maybe i'll true. change that to mary and then flip them all right just okay different. just to be different that's our show um we release episodes every single friday you can follow us on socials at those forking pharaohs on instagram and please let us give us some deets of your boy or, or girl wh- whatever yeah. floats your boat give it to us tell give us, us the if you're embarrassed by our choices too yeah yeah <laughs> anything any opinions any thoughts we'd love to hear it you can follow us on instagram chloe runs our socials these are social media manager so follow us all of our links are going to be in the show notes and of course the links are our patreons in our show notes we are about to go record fangirl tea time Yay. which is going to be fun and our extra show our podcast is edited by jake needham and alex polis with music by cole jenkins and vocals by heather trasca and uh, we release episodes every Friday. I said that already. I'm Christine. I'm Natasha. And I'm Chloe. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.